finally for some interesting story so if you're into toys you might be interested here that you know uh a toy me from the Trans transformer animated series if you're familiar the autobots and the decepticons if you're familiar <laughs> so way back in my time anyway so obviously if you're familiar with the transformers the their vehicles or whatever if it's an airplane or a truck or a land-based vehicle they transform that's why it's called a transformers right to transform into a robot to any type of vehicle right and used to be when you play with them you have to uh play with it transform it piece by piece so it would let's say if you're optimus prime from a robot physical standing you know how how, how many inches then it would convert back to a truck or if it's bumblebee and so forth right uh, what's interesting here, you know, a, a partnership between two companies, uh, between ha Hasbro, which owns the rights for Transformers, has partnered with Robosend Robotics to actually create an actually transforming Transformer, literally and figuratively. And obviously, it's going to not going to be cheap. The fact that you know Transformer figures as, is already expensive, but having that capability is, you know looking tremendous here but anyway let's take a closer look here so here we can see optimus prime here so uh the company uh is able to transform as mentioned optimus from an actual vehicle to a bipedal robot which is standing right now and it comes along with all those bells and whistles the sound effects and all which is going to be interesting now how much is it stay, stay tuned for a bit so as mentioned, so the company Robots and Robotics is partnering with the toy maker Hashbro. So to bring the Autobots uh, leader back to life, literally and figuratively, right? So it's going to be a collectible <laughs> if, if you like to collect toys. So what's interesting here is if you say the following keywords, I would say commands. So hey Optimus and you can see how it transforms itself. So I think it has a video here. So you can see here from the actual standing Optimus to an actual truck here. Do they have the actual video? Ah, there you go. So you can see here. So it's it's not edited, so it's moving on its own. So it's very interesting here. Now, uh, it's using its 27 server motor spring into action, making the character animate as it, as it responds with the iconic booming voice of Optimus from the cartoon series, right? And then you can use an app uh, to use it as a remote control to have it walk or drive around in track form. So it makes an interesting case here. And another thing here, if you say roll out, you can watch Optimus go from robot to truck and drive off. So, you know, if you're a kid, you've been <laughs> ambitioning it to actually do it by itself rather than see it in, in TV or in films, uh, this is the best time. And obviously, uh, it stands, the figurine stands as 19 inches. So, not that big, but it's big enough, you know. And then, its chest and arms moves up and down slightly as it stands, awaiting your command. So, as you can clearly see here. So, you know, it's not the best iteration, but it can do its job. So, you know, it's a work in progress. So, you can just imagine in the future that, you know, toys would be doing this as a norm rather than as a as a unique feature here so it also has 80 sound effects in total so it would be quite interesting so if you're a toy lover here in particular you like transformers here would you be interested to buy it now if you're interested how much is it going to cost you well you'll be surprised it's not going to be cheap it's around 700 dollars here so <laughs> it's as expensive as a brand new smartphone here but Hey, that's what you pay for for you know a new unique features here, and would you still buy it? S despite that, so would be interesting to see here.